есть вопросы, которые требуют дополнительного внимания. Russian President Vladimir Putin has declared that the Russian occupying grouping of forces in Ukraine total 617,000 military personnel. The front line length is over 2,000 kilometers, with 617,000 people deployed across the combat zone, he said, the Russian armed forces have been receiving a significant number of new weapons and equipment in recent years as part of a modernization program aimed at enhancing the country's military capabilities, there will be peace when we will achieve our goals, Putin said, repeating a frequent Kremlin line. He alleged that Kiev was sacrificing its troops in order to show some success to its Western sponsors as it seeks more aid. When Putin launching his troops on Ukraine in February 2022, he requested the denazification of its pro-Western neighbor. He also demanded the demilitarization of Ukraine, which was fending off Russia's assault. As for demilitarization, they don't want to negotiate, so we are then forced to take other measures, including military measures, Putin said. There will be peace when we achieve our goals. They are not changing. I will remind you what we talked about the denazification and demilitarization of Ukraine and its neutral status, he said.